Installing ExactView. Did you know that the install process has changed for systems running ExactView version 3099 or newer? Well, it has, and it's now super easy to install. We will first need to bring up the web browser on our PBX. In our example, this is phone.abc.com colon 2001. If you're not sure about how to access your PBX's web interface, please contact your phone administrator for instructions. You should see a screen like this. Click on the Operator Panel link and then click Launch Now. You will now need to save the launch.jnlp to your system. Before you run the application, choose to Always Trust Content from this publisher. Otherwise, this window will appear every time you open ExactView. Then, just simply click Run. You'll be prompted to read and agree to the terms of the license agreement. Check the box at the bottom left and click Accept. Now it's time to create your new profile by providing your server login information. The location and tenant fields should already be populated for you like shown below. If not, the location should be default in the case of premise-based systems and should be the deployment ID of the server for hosted systems. Then enter your username, which is your extension number, and finally your password. Your password will be given by your system administrator. Otherwise, it defaults to secret. And there you go. You're now up to date with the easy to use and affordable call management system, ExactView. Now, if you are not able to find your ExactView location or your ExactView password, you can follow these steps. To verify the location name, you can also log in to the admin GUI of your PBX. Click on the module called ExactView. You should now see the location name on your screen. To verify your ExactView password, click on the module called Extensions. On the right side, pick your extensions, and now we will scroll down to the section about ExactView. The field called Secret is where we can see our password or define a new password. See, I told you that would be easy.